Executive Summary Tutorial and Instructions. The first written section of the business plan is the Executive Summary. This is a summary of the key points and areas of the business plan and is many times judged to be the most important section of the business plan. In the Executive Summary, the content presents the company and describes what it does. In the executive summary, briefly explain the company's product, products, and or service, services, and why the business will be successful. The executive summary should be at the beginning of the document. As the first section, it should give the reader, either management, partners, investors, lenders, or other interested parties, a nice high-level review of what the overall business encompasses and the strategies it will follow. What is in the executive summary should be addressed in depth throughout the remainder of the business plan. The summary should touch on the sections and content that will be detailed in the business plan to give an overall understanding of what will follow. Be captivating, but not overly puffy, as to encourage the reader to want to get deeper into each section and read the whole plan. Make the main points about who, how, and what the company is and does. Given the fact that the executive summary is at the front of the business plan, usually read first and encompasses sections from the whole document, it becomes a key component of the business plan and as such needs to be strong and crisp. Pull in the reader by encompassing the main points of the business, but just give them high points so that they are enticed to read the rest of the document. A subheading in the executive summary is the financial summary. Here in the business plan, it is common to show the financial highlights for the company over the next few years of operation. Many times a chart is put here to convey the highlights of the financial summary. Financial outlooks such as revenue, expenses, and profits are chartered here. The next subheading in the executive summary is the mission statement. The mission statement is a short declaration of who the company is, what it provides, and its beliefs. The overall philosophy of what the company advocates can be addressed in the mission statement. Finally, in the executive summary, are objectives. Objectives for a company are clearly defined targets that are set by management or business owners. The marks the company intends to hit by executing on strategies in the plan are written here. Listing company objectives helps to give management and all stakeholders a clear perspective on what targets the company expects to pursue. These targets do not only have to be financial. Looking at and reviewing objectives can give a means for a company to track growth and reflect on how the company is doing based on what it stated it would do. Objectives should take into account the desires of all those involved with the company. Using the plug and play template to write an executive summary for a salon company can be done by simply finding the yellow highlighted space on the page and entering your company name. There is also a blue highlighted space where you can type in the location on where you will be providing salon services. If you would like to use the template content as a guide and make changes to the writing to best suit your exact business, you can do that as well. You are welcome to stay with the written content the temple supplies if suitable for your company. 
Using the plug and plan template, the next page has a chart which provides a financial summary of the company's next three years of operations. This chart highlights total income and net income. After you have customized the financial statements for your specific company, you want to return to this chart and make changes so that they match your new financial statements. By right-clicking this chart, a pop-out will appear. The pop-out will give you several options. You want to scroll down to Edit Data or Edit Data in Excel, and the data table will appear. Once you're in the table, type in and make the necessary changes to the figures. The plug and plan template provides a mission statement. You are welcome to use the statement as if, as long as it'll work for you, or change if needed to match up to your exact operation. The plug and plan template also provides some sample example objectives for a salon company. You are welcome to use them as is if they will work for your specific company or change if needed to match your exact operation.